Hello there and welcome back to some more Grand Turismo 4. Today we're continuing on well, Let's Play. This is episode 81. In today's episode we're taking a look at the final special condition event that we ever have to do. It's Cathedral Rock <gasps> time again. Uh, which means, once again, it's time to Subaru. Um, and for our final rally car, we'll use in this game, at least for a special condition event, we're buying a 2003 Impreza rally car. For fans of the Evo 8 Super Rally, don't fear, I'll show that off at some point later on. I think I've actually got a few rally cars penciled in later on. Because again, lots of rally cars, I need variety in this. Variety's good, isn't it, yeah. Ludo? Yeah, maybe. It's like when you tie people up, you like to give them a variety. Maybe. Maybe. Baby. Everybody says she's looking good. And the lady knows it's understood. Strutter. We'll get copyright struck because I sound exactly like Gene Simmons. Anyways. Look at this shit. Look, look. Gold, 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 gold. Last thing. Only one left. Also, one quick thing worth noting. At the end of the last episode, we were 49% of the way through the game. Oh. So, this is the last chance for you lot who said we'll reach 50% in the uh, special condition events. And, and, if, and if we don't reach 50% of them, then the entire comment section has the ability to call you all bad names. Then they can move through themselves like they do. Like Freakazoid, you come and wind me up. I'm just a musical legend tonight. So, straight away, a few things to note about this Impreza. Mm -hmm. They did a slightly bot, but I mean, it hasn't got the silly headlight covers the old rally version has. The, the rear end looks slightly worse. But on the plus side, I can actually see if I go into the uh, this mode now because there's no silly aerials in the way. Yay! Instead, there's like a weird silver snorkel thing. I don't know what that's all about, but there you go. I also don't know why those people are stood at the weirdest angle I've ever seen people stood at, but there you go. It's it's really fun. They they, they are strange. They are not they are not human beings. They are very fun. Yes. Also, can we just note something? What? Mm -hmm. How this might have been one of the better recording sessions we've ever had for GT4. Maybe. Yeah. It's been relaxed. It's nice yeah. to have relaxed every now and again. Thank you. I like having fucking... I like chaos once in a while, but, you know, sometimes it's nice to just... Sit back, relax, talk cars. I mean, I mean, I mean, you will have you will have in chaos when you do twenty-four hour race. Yes, I'm quite happy to have chaos for twenty-four hours. That's fine by me. Mm -hmm. The thing is, the the whole chaos thing, it works for longer events, but for short ones like these, it just sort of doesn't. Yeah, because everything gets cut in the in the mid time, downtime between episodes. Exactly. But, speaking of short things, as is Kark, no, and speaking of other short things, um, we are not speaking of short things. Um, after this, it's manufacturer racing, which <sighs> is very short, and I'm, I can't tell you how excited I am to do manufacturer racing. When do you do the best one? The one I have to be there for? Yeah, I'll make sure to bug the shit out of you to get involved in that one. I don't so fucking care if you're in Germany or driving home from the way from Germany to France, you're fucking being in that one. Yeah, I, 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 mean, I mean, it's cool because I don't want to go back to late at night or something like that. It's, so if you just say you don't do it on Sundays, it's good. Yeah, fuck doing it on Sundays. But yeah, manufacturer races ever, should be short. Because if I ever get to drive when you're going to without that, to go back to, it will be to come back from friends and it will be Sunday night, so I'm recording that day. Yeah. But yeah, the um, the manufacturer races should be fun. And of course, I, the, I like it how most of the time it's lost sight, I'm going to do it in my order. 
but with the manufacturer races, if anyone's actually taken a look at the GC4 Let's Play breakdown, you might notice a certain event that's probably the most requested one from the manufacturer cups is the first thing we're doing. <laughs> Fucking, I may as well hype it so I get as many views as possible. Uh, tomorrow, uh, if I'm still doing these daily by this time, which hopefully I am, uh, tomorrow we're going midget racing. Oh god! Yay! And then the day after that we're going Copen racing. Oh god. Yes, yeah, so and that's going to be the calm before the storm, because after manufacturer events it's back to extreme event hell. Where we have like six hours of jerk-off cake. And I wait. Oh wait, no, it's not endurance yet. No, uh, to be honest with you, the worst thing is extreme events aren't actually that terrible. Like, most of them are like GT3 length. Until you reach Formula GT and then after that it's just like, can I die now? And then obviously you've got the endurance races. How uh, long is the Formula GT uh, 15 hours, oh sorry, 20 hours. Uh, uh, to give you an idea, you know how I format, like, decently long videos? Mm -hmm. It's gonna be five parts Formula GT. Oh god. Oh. Because it's like actual full length Formula 1 races. But yeah, it's, that's gonna be the longest championship in the game because that's going to be five episodes uh, the 24 hour races are going to be split into four parts I believe uh, I, th I, th I think you should limit that to eight hours huh? I think you, on YouTube you can upload eight hours no you can upload literally days of content yeah yeah but I mean on the I'm not going to do a 24 hour video because I'm not fucking letting it render that long. Yeah, yeah, I, I think I the know. longest... Yeah, I'm not... Sh you know some of like... The, there's some weird endurances that are like 8 hours long and stuff. I'm not quite sure what I'm doing with them. I think they might be two-parters but I'm not 100% sure. Yeah. yeah, but what I mean is I think for it, you should it in 3 times 8 or 24 hours. Hold on, let me have a quick look down here. Uh, yeah, the Tsarf is four parts, Nürburgring's four parts, Formula GT's five parts. Tsuba's gonna be apparently one entire video, so that's a nine hour video. Uh -oh. Which I plan to make that like my absolute longest video ever. Like, that's. that I'm not going any longer than that. That could get fucked. <laughs> that's, going to, that's going to take some time to fucking render. Yeah, that's probably gonna be like an 11, 12 hour render. But then again, there's one advantage, it's to sort of, and I may as well say this now, people will probably get the message, like, when it thing is, after the manufacturer race is undone, this might start slowing down massively. Like, GC4 probably, like, during the endurance phase, I would love to have this be, like, one of, like, literally the only Let's Play I've ever done, where it's just, like, consistent episodes, like, in a row, but, oh, by the way, the final rally event we do in the game, Evo versus Impreza. All right, I'm I'm good with this. Yeah, that's fine. So we can this finally is... settle this once and for all. What's better, Evo or Impreza? In before you lose. Yeah, in before Evo. But yeah, we're um. What was I saying? Yeah. Uh, once we get to the endurance races, these might slow down significantly. Because I'm not being funny, I'm not going to be able to like bang them out like recording session like like these. We've done ten or so episodes in one night. No, just no. no. When it comes to the endurance races, uh, that will probably be like one a day. If it's like the two-hour ones, we might be able to get two or three of those in. But there's only so much I can mentally take, and there's only so many days I have off in a week. So yeah. Probably gonna slow down at some point, which probably should be expected. But don't worry, I will get through all the endurances. Like I, that's not gonna be my breaking point. We will get through them, but 
do bear in mind it will probably take some time. It's sort of like how Rhino did his, isn't it? Because when he was doing the Grand Turismo 5 B spec things, he'd like yeah. one of his like segments like weekly or something. It won't be weekly, it'll probably be every couple of days. I'll probably... When the endurance races start kicking in, that's probably when I'll start uploading something like Toka 2. Just to sort of take the heat off. But, but then, uh, right now he did, it, he did it as when he could, basically. Yeah. Yeah, it's only going to be when I can. I'm not going to fucking push yeah, myself to yeah, extreme. I mean, and, and, but, but the thing you cannot take into account is the because actually as uh, saving in, in the race. Yeah. Which GT4 doesn't support GT4, you have to keep the, the thing away, so it's better to do it as fast as Oh, I've already said I'm doing 24 hour races, I'm gonna end up killing myself, basically. Yeah, 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 but what I mean is the... Uh, the, the annoying thing with GT4 is that you are... Even if you remove the disc like when you did, you keep the console running, so you better finish it as fast as you can, so you don't let your console run for two weeks. Yeah, it's, well, Rhino did it is over the course of two weeks. Yeah. But I'm not doing that. Like, literally, once I start a 24 hour endurance yeah. race, it will be done in about two days. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It'll literally be a case of I will do a 12, 13, 14 hour stint one day, and then I will do a. however, you know, whatever's left the next day. It'll basically be a case of. Something. Wake up in the morning, start the game, start yeah. the endurance running, work through the night on it, go to sleep, wake back up, finish it. And and, and you know, that's actually, I think, the, the only time we can say that GT5 actually had something that is actually useful. Yeah, Saving here's the thing, I, I'm going to warn you lot now, I will not be in a happy mood during the endurance events. Why? I, well, if I'm like fucking up like 14, 15, 16 hours playing the same event and then having to wake up the next day super early to finish the final 8 hours of it, probably not going to be a happy person. Mm. Just warning that now, so if, if I'm a little bit unbearable during like the 2 or 3 wait, weeks when the endurance wait, races wait, are a thing. Wait, 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 I mean like, I have a thing to ask, you are already unbearable, so... Ha! <laughs> Love you too. <laughs> Dick. I mean, I'm, fr I'm French or English. <laughs> we have to hate each other. Oh, yeah, right. Isn't that what? I mean, okay, our countries don't hate each other as much now, but they did that for, like, for fucking centuries. <laughs> fucking, I'm I mean, just excited for my 24 hour stream. Yeah. yeah, that's going to be fun because you say you will. No, it's not. Well, no, if the no, internet cuts out halfway through, it won't be fun, but. Wait, I'm, I'm streaming. Oh, wait, I'm not anymore. God. I mean, knowing, knowing you, you bit of fucking lazy just back up. Back up, back up. Tell me what you're gonna do now. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. What? I thought I'd never do that again. Now, I know you be loving this shit right here in the IMP. Biscuit is right here. People with a house in the mountain of the year. Because if you don't care, then we don't care. One times two times three to the six. Chosen something something with that limp biscuit mix. So where the fuck you at? Okay. Shut the fuck up and back the fuck up. Holy fuck this track up. Fuck this track. Can we just make a joke? Eight out of ten. Yeah. You were okay. This is a stock in Pretzel Rally car. I'm destroying an Evo 8 with it. Yeah. I can sort of see why the general recommendation for the rally events is just buy the O3 in Pretzel. And do every single event with it. Apart from Sakuba Wet, obviously. But you know me, I'm not boring. I have to use a different car each and every single time. Nerd. And of course, do you know what the best way to finish the rally events are? By beating an Evo while being penalised. <laughs> Get that penalty one last time as we cross the line. Anyways, here comes the truth to find out. A, obviously, what prize car we get, and B, are we going to get the 50% prize car? 
all to figure out. Dun, dun, dun. That song is just right. Congratulations. Defined. There's the Pajero that you get for winning this one. Oh, well, that's bad. I actually I like, like it. You're it's such a weird looking thing. That's what I like about it. It's so strange. And that's already red. No, you don't. Okay. Oh. Uh, Does that mean we're going to cross 50% when we're racing fucking Daihatsus? Yes. 49.4% <laughs> complete, apparently. Interesting. Fucking hell. Anyways, Mitsu, 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 Bishi, Mitsu, Bishi, Mitsu, 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 03. It's the Mitsubishi Pajero Evolution Super Production Rally Raid Car. Holy shit, what a name. That's a name. That is a... How... Mitsubishi Pajero... Mitsu... Hold on. It's a Mitsubishi Motors Pajero Evolution Super Production Rally Raid Car. Uh. With the burp on the end. That's like... A lot of words. It's worth so... a lot of money, though. It's worth as much as every rally car. No. Emil, uh, Some of them are Emil? different. Yeah. Every interesting one. I, I think I'm, I'm beginning to be like you. Why? I'm I'm actually looking at the thing that's uh, say auto select peace peaks ever. <laughs> oh Jesus. <laughs> Anyways, we've owned we've earned a hundred and seven prize cards apparently so far. Oh. Nineteen forty nine point four percent completion, and that's also gone. Also, I have something to say. I know what your obsessions are, and I agree. Yes. My what? I know why she was your obsession. She still is. It's just I have a different one to aim for now as well. Yeah. <laughs> well, I need to figure out how tall this other one is, because if she's taller than me, then that's a bit awkward. Anyways, <laughs> thank you all very much for watching this edition of Gran Turismo 4. Uh, that is the final rally event we ever have to do. Special thank condition events up. are done we are done actually i should show those off shouldn't i might as let's well. go through all the happy memories and by happy memories i've been project wendy house and friends yeah project wendy house is probably the only good thing that came out of these we raced a couple of years mm. i like the special condition events i haven't really got any complaints about them other than I the fact project paris exists anyways thank you all very much for watching and until next time when we take a look at the manufacturer cup races farewell <laughs>